What's up, A gang? We are back at again with a weekly vlog, y'all. It is Monday, and it's probably around 1.30-ish. I don't know. I, I can't see the time. But I am up. I've been, y'all, I have not been up for a while, but I have been up for a few hours now. Um, I didn't go to bed till like 4 o'clock in the morning last night because I literally could not fall asleep. I don't know what that's all about. I just never can fall asleep at night now. Um, so I didn't fall asleep until around four-ish in the morning, which meant I did not get up until 11. I didn't get out the bed until like 11.45. I was just in the bed, scrolling on my phone, checking emails, um, stuff like that. Um, so yeah, it's Monday. What do we have planned today? Absolutely nothing. So it's supposed to be the eclipse is supposed to be here today. And it actually looked like it might be already like in the motion because it's getting a little um, like, you can't really tell on camera. It's getting a little dull outside. It's not dark yet. It's just getting a little dull. Um, I'm staying my ass in the house. <laughs> no, I'm not going nowhere to, to watch it. No, I, I'm not doing none of that shit. I don't care. I Whatever it is what it is. Um, not something I'm interested in. So my ass is in the house. Um, I am making me some boiled eggs right now because I'm hungry. But I really don't know what I want to eat. Um, I, I ate horribly over the weekend. Um, so I want to try to like pull it back in a little bit. We are going to Alexa's school today. Uh, she has practice today. They uh, pushed practice back because of the eclipse. Uh, I wasn't gonna go, but I'm gonna go just so I can get like an outdoor workout in. I need to stop and get me a jump rope. Um, yeah, I used to jump rope for cardio all the time years ago, and I lost my jump rope when we moved. So I don't know where it's at, so I wanna go get another one. Cause I kinda wanna incorporate, you know, some jumping rope um, into my cardio again. I'm trying to like spice things up so I don't feel like I'm doing the same stuff over and over again because that's when I get bored. Kyra, why are you, you see that I'm talking to our company and now you want to act like you don't know what you're supposed to be doing. Cl I, climb. Climb. Yeah, he keep on getting off his cot and right now he's in, he's not necessarily in time out. He just, you know, you need a nap. Like sit down and take a nap or something. Anyway, um, so yeah, so I'm making eggs, boiled eggs. I know some people probably hate boiled eggs. I, I can eat boiled eggs before I can eat like scrambled eggs. I just made boiled eggs and I put like a sweet chili sauce on it. I know that probably sounds gross, but it is so, so good. Don't knock it until you try it. I just drizzle chili, uh, sweet chili sauce on it and I eat my boiled eggs like that. It's pretty good. Y'all, nails are still going strong. It will be two weeks on Friday. I was trying to give y'all a 30 day update, but I just feel like I don't wanna drag it out to 30 days because I really wanna change these to something else. But then again, I do wanna drag it out to 30 days because I wanna like prove if the glue is what everybody is saying that it is. So I don't know, we'll see. I know I will for sure do an update on TikTok on Friday because it'll make officially two weeks. And um, my friend said, she wanted me to do a two week update because she normally get her nails done every two weeks. So she's interested to see how well the glue holds for two weeks. So I'm gonna do that for her. So yeah, so that, or, that is what the day is consistent of. It is getting gloomier and gloomier by the moment. Um, so I think the eclipse is coming. Y'all, I remember as a kid in elementary school, um, at Woodland Elementary in Jennings, uh, we had in class, we made some type of contraption where we didn't look at, you know, the sun or whatever, the, the moon or whatever the hell it is. We didn't look at it, but we had made this thing, this project where we can actually look at this paper and see it as it covers the sun. I don't remember it working, but I remember doing the project and I remember as a kid being so excited and we all went outside and we all put our little paper on the ground and we were just looking at it and looking at it. Yeah, I don't I don't remember if it worked or not. It probably did, it probably didn't, I don't know. 
who knows i don't remember um so yeah y'all that is um that is the plan for today also i did start posting uh stuff from my closet cairo don't start don't start go climb 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 also um i don't know if y'all remember when i was telling y'all how i was spring cleaning my closet and i was trying to figure out how i wanted to resell some of, some of the stuff that i had in my closet that i was a not wearing anymore or b just didn't want and somebody gave me a really good idea to just put the stuff on my website so i did put the stuff on my website but i also created a instagram page where I would like list the things as I, as I, um, you know, as like put the thing, post the things as I, y'all know what I'm trying to say, shit. Um, so make sure y'all go check out the Instagram, check out the website as well. I will put that in the description. It's not much stuff up there, uh, right now because it's not like a ton of stuff that I'm trying to get rid of. A lot of stuff that I did get rid of, I just gave it away. Um, these are just my high ticket items that I am parting ways with. Um, so yes, they are expensive. No, I'm not giving away anything for the super, super low low. Um, I paid a lot of money for these things. Of course, I know that I'm not going to get back what I spent on them. Um, but I'm still not getting ready to just give those things away for little or nothing. Um, so if that's not your thing, then that page is not for you. That website is not for you. So don't even waste your time trying to go look. Yes, it does. <clears throat> on my website, you can use... Um, What's those little uh, companies that do like the payment plans? I'm not familiar with the name. What is it called? Um, yeah, I can't think of the name. Somebody asked me about it and I remember seeing it when I set my website and stuff up. I remember seeing it. Afterpay. It does have Afterpay on there. So if you're one of those people that you like to break payments up on stuff, by all means, go for it. Um, the only way you get to the Afterpay is if you go through the whole checkout process. So as you're going through the checkout process, it'll eventually give you the option to do Afterpay. Um, I, so I did want to put that out there because somebody else had asked me about it and I told them no because I didn't realize it was on there until I went back on there and like went through some shit and figured it out. So um, it does offer after pay. Um, make sure you just keep checking the Instagram page or if you follow the Instagram page, then you would know you'll get notification every time I do post something new because uh, I plan on posting stuff on there. You know what I'm saying? Periodically throughout the year when I decide, okay, it's time for me to part ways with these items. So thank you to whoever gave me that idea because that was an awesome idea. Um, I normally sell stuff on Poshmark, but Poshmark, they just, they're, they're charging ways too much like commission is like 20% or something like that and I'm like I ain't that damn hard up to be giving y'all 20% when I could put the 20% back in my pockets okay mm -hmm. so yeah I just wanted to address that because I forgot to tell y'all about it in the last weekly vlog uh, so uh, again the, the again the uh, links and stuff to that will be in the description also today I am working on trying to get Cairo's birthday party stuff together. So um, that's what I am working on right now. I'm on Amazon, just trying to find like um, decorations and things of that sort. Yay me. Um, but other than that, I'm gonna sit here, wait for it to get dark from the eclipse and then go work out. I am um, using this Alani Cherry Slush uh, packet. I'm putting it in my water. Um, this was something they sent me. I really don't care for this this particular flavor. It's giving tart uh, lemonade, in my opinion. Uh, but it helps give me just a little boost of energy. And then it, it also, so I don't know if y'all realize that anything with caffeine, um, caffeine in it, it can suppress your appetite. Um, I don't like getting in the habit of suppressing my appetite because that's just a... That's just a disaster waiting to happen. 
Uh, but sometimes it's cool when I'm just sitting around the house working because I've noticed that when I'm at home and I'm just, you know, on the computer, just I tend to snack because I'm bored. So it does help me like, you know, eat actual meals and not just be around here, here snacking because I'm bored. Because if I keep going, if I keep going that, that way, I'm going to be in Turks and Caicos looking thick. Thicker than a schnicker and not in the right places, okay? My my thickness is gonna be around my midsection and in my back or some shit. Watch. It ain't gonna be in my ass and legs like some some women are lucky to have. Mine's go in all the wrong freaking places. So I am rambling now because y'all know a girl can get to talking, honey. So we just gonna get this vlog started. Make hey, sure so you stretch down. Done doing your coach duties. Yeah. For the day. Yeah. How many you done? I want, okay? If you're going slow like that, once you get in the race and other people start running, and you start running, then you're gonna be like, what's going on? No, so you gotta run through the thing. Remember that trail leg? Bring it over, okay? Snap that lead down. Make sure you rest, okay? Can't do too much now. You've been going back to back to back to back. Take a break for a second. super early but it ain't really late either um i've been up for about an hour now i had to tidy up the kitchen and feed the dogs let them out so they can potty um as y'all see as y'all can see i just did my skincare routine that's pretty much what i do every morning um my products you use my products that I use changes often. That's why I don't really like sharing products with y'all. Be this is really getting out of hand, Cairo. Now you about to fall because you're trying to stand on my dang on stool. The amount of attention this dog needs is crazy. What can I do for you, sir? You want to be in the video too? Okay. And for some reason, I feel like the lighting on this video is trash. And I don't know why. Yeah, you fail. He's he's standing on this with his front paws. Just so he can be in the mix. So anyway, uh, I don't like sharing with y'all the products that I use. Because I, I change them so often. The only, Cairo, we have to stop. What do you need? Can I help you? The only product that I use that stays the same is my 
my scone, my toner, my um blemish toner. I couldn't think of the freaking name. My blemish toner. This is a different bottle than what it comes in. This is a beer bottle because this is my personal stash. Um, but that's the same label. Um, the bottles that it come in is a rose gold. So this is a different bottle, but it's this same exact product. This is the only thing that stay. You made me hit myself in the chin with this. This this is the only thing that stays the same. I have been using this for about four or five years now, and I never change it because it has done so much for my skin that Cairo, get down. Can you get down? Jesus. It's not off, Cairo, off, off. So anyway, I just got another PR package from Kiehl's. Um, I don't know if y'all are familiar with Kiehl's. I wasn't at first until maybe a few months ago when they sent me my first PR package and I gave a lot of it away to my friend Kimietta and she called me and was like, girl, you know what this stuff costs? And she started running down the prices and I'm like, ooh, I should have kept that. Uh, but they, Cairo, off. No. And what are you doing? You look, you look like you did something you ain't supposed to be doing. Talking to Bentley. Anyway, um, this time they sent me the facial cream. So I haven't, I haven't tried. I haven't even opened it. Is it sealed? Yeah, it's sealed. Um, I'll open it when I'm ready to try it. I get so many PR packages from um, skincare companies, which is crazy because I have my own skincare line. But as we all know, I only have the uh, skin toner so far. I haven't added like the, um, the face creams and the uh, the cleansers, which I am. They're coming. Um, but I like to use one product at a time. So this company, it, they send me a, a PR package and I know everything is turned. Cairo! Off. You did not the whole stupid over. Um, I know that I'm I'm recording with my front facing camera, so y'all gonna have to read backwards. But they sent me a PR package with a ton of product, and I've been I've been trying their stuff so far so good. Um, again, I'm not married to any skincare products except for my own. My skincare changes. If y'all go look at my skincare routine on some old vlogs, y'all will see that the products that I was using was totally different. Totally. Because I changed them all the time. I have not found a product that I swear by when it comes to skincare except for my blemish toner. And I know I might be being biased, but I mean, it's hard not to be when you have a product that literally helped you with your acne and you don't have acne anymore. I had acne for a, a little minute and now I have no issues with acne. So that's a different story for a different day. I keep telling y'all this over and over and over again. So y'all get y'all get the point. But anyway, I am still in my PJs because I, I don't plan on going anywhere today. Um, I need to go to the gym, but I probably won't go to the gym today because there are some things that I need to really get done. Um, first thing on my list is my taxes. I have not done my taxes in two years. I haven't done 2022 and 2023, 2022. Two was already late and 2023 finna be late. So I was like, let me, let me get on my Zoom. Um, and let me, and yes, I do my own taxes. Um, I've always, I've done my own taxes from day one. I've never, never paid nobody to do my taxes. But anyway, so I need to sit down and get that done. Um, and I need to edit some videos. I have a video that needs to go out on TikTok today. So I need to edit that, get that out. Also, yesterday I had a meeting with TikTok. Um, they invited me into their established creative program. And I had a meeting with, I guess I would call him like my TikTok rep. I don't know what the the right terminology for it is, but we just gonna call him my TikTok rep for right now because he will be my point of contact um, for anything that I need as far as TikTok is concerned, which is great because if y'all are on TikTok, y'all all know that when you have issues with your account, it is 
hard as hell to get in contact with TikTok to get that fixed. So now I have a point of contact, which I am excited about that. Um, also, we will be having, um, I think, monthly one-on-one -on -one meetings, um, kind of going over my analytics, videos, things of that sort. So it just kind of pushed me in the right direction. Y'all, this could not have came any more on time. Y'all are being rude. Hey, y'all are being rude. This, this, is, this came on time because I literally was struggling with TikTok and I was one foot out the door. That's why y'all see me on here a lot more often because I am just so over TikTok. But apparently my dogs don't want me to be great. Y'all, I'm picking this thing on my finger. That's why I keep looking down. My dogs literally won't let me be great today because they want to fight over a freaking toy. So I guess that's my cue to shut up and get my freaking day started. I'm over the tennis ball. <laughs> Yeah, it's fun policing his right. coaching elements. One more. Oh, Wait, let the boys go first. Two back to more. Yeah, y'all be yeah. boys with us. Y'all be hey. boys with us. You hungry? Go back, go back. Go back, come on. Tamira here. <laughs> okay, okay, this this me I'm getting PR because I fixed my technique a little and then when I threw it um a couple of days ago I almost hit 10 and my PR is 9.35. So hopefully we get like a 9.7. Hopefully. No, we're gonna go 10. So. 10? Yeah. 10 was my record like goal for the end of the year, but well, well, why wait to the end of the year? Let's do it now. Right. Okay. okay. Which was sophomore now? I was sophomore, yeah. Into okay. existence. Speak yeah, Tamara used to live down the street from us. I don't know if y'all remember her or not. Before we moved. <laughs> and she gonna go she gonna throw ten tomorrow. Yeah, I heard from the fun police. Yeah. I'ma be I'm checking. I'ma be over there. <laughs> I'ma have to come check. Not no pressure. <laughs> <laughs> no pressure. Man. No pressure. No you pressure got it. Too. I know. People that can do it. Right. Long. You can do it. As long as no, like, state champions are there. Cause That's even better. As y'all can see, I am at practice with the fun police and Lexi. I got me a workout in. I ran. I did some stadiums. Um, now I'm just kind of walking around, just doing whatever. I need to really retwist these damn vlogs. I know I keep saying that every time I come on the camera, and it still ain't been done yet. So let's see what else they doing before we leave. Why are y'all sitting down? We're done with practice. Y'all done? We just got here. No, we ain't. I ain't seen y'all do nothing. I did some. <laughs> huh? Don't we can keep the top. I hope what's in the water. Why? Why that way? They hard. Look at the black and red. Why is it red though? Y'all colors ain't red. Red's my favorite color. We got is it? Red, I had a purple one. I didn't give it back. So I switched yeah. it out, put it back in. Now I can take this one. You look like your mama today. That moment, really? Keep that speed and you'll get the This side view of it. Really? <laughs> the side. We got the same um, profile, side profile. Y'all get the same nose. Do we? That's cute nose. That's why I thought you got to smoke them all. She's got the braids. Well, those aren't exactly braids. Box. <laughs> You look like a shark. You look like How a shark. Like How are you sharp? Like those you look like a naked roll, right? You look like a Yeah. I used to be that short. I was like, what do I look like? Yeah. <laughs> so what do you got? So y'all leaving? Yeah. Y'all yeah. just got here, though. Sherry, you've been here for like five minutes. <laughs> I'm just playing. They've been here for a while. All right, y'all ready for the meet Saturday, Friday, Thursday, whatever day it is. Thursday and Friday. What you running? To 
tomorrow on Thursday, I'm doing long jump, and then Friday I'm doing four by two and four hundred. Period. It's meat day for Lexi, so do you have to, you lock, okay, go ahead. Come on, please gotta use the bathroom. We trying to get a snack. We are on our way to Alexis track meet. Uh, we running a little behind because the fun police was working. He was doing something, so. Currently in Target. It's, we didn't, Lexi track meet over. She, she has day two tomorrow, but we in Target because a hurdle coach that she worked with he just had a baby and we wanted to get them a gift they just had a little girl it's been a couple of weeks but they had a little girl so we want to get them a little gift right quick we've been wanting to get a gift but we didn't realize that he was going to be at the track meet so now that we know he's going to be at the track meet we're like oh we can get it now and give it to him at the track meet fun police is adamant about getting a blanket so you like this because you holding it in your hand mm-hmm is, is this a blanket? They don't feel like... This, this, it ain't a thick blanket. It's, what does it say? It say muslin blankets. I don't know what that is. Ideal for swallowing or use as receiving blanket. Yeah. Well, it's a little thin. That's a little thin one. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I guess... It's a big one. Okay, you can get that one. You said, I think this is cool. I mean, if you want, you can get that. I think this is cool. It's a nice thick blanket. <laughs> you done? Yep. Ain't nothing else you want to get? I'm These are receiving blankets, too. I'm still looking. Let's see. Yeah, I think them are receiving blankets. Or you like that one better? Uh, I don't know. It's got one in here that's cool. <laughs> but you know, you know what I'm saying? It doesn't have to be that one. Those are the ones with the flowers. Yeah. I think these. I think these feel better. We'll get those, yeah. man. That's flannel. Yeah. This ain't flannel. That's the good shit. That's the good shit? Mm hmm. That's it. I mean, the I, <laughs> I was over there looking at clothes, and you was like, "That's not what I had in mind." I had, I wanted to get blankets. They got a little towel. This is nice. A little robe. Oh, All right, right, look at this. This is a little towel, a little bath towel. that yeah. look like a what's that? I don't know what type of animal that is. I don't know. You have a second thoughts about your receiving blankets? Uh-uh. I like these blankets. Well, just keep those. You like those because you, you holding on to them. So those are towels. All of these are towels. Oh, okay. This is the towel area. Hence the robe. It's robe, right? Oh, nice. It is. It's cute. Okay. We want the robe too. Yeah. And that's it. That's it. Mhm. Mm All right. <laughs> okay. And we end up getting the baby stuff. I end up getting this bag. This is so cute. And then we got that. The blankets that the fun police. Was adamant about, about getting. You got two blankets? 
Yeah, he was really adamant about this. And a robe. Mm. That's cute. And then we got the tissue paper that's going to go. I told him that I said, oh, yeah, I'm going to give it to him. Maybe it'll um, bring him out of retirement for the, for the section. Right. He ends the turn quicker. Right. Like, like, I had left class at 140 because I was not staying in that class. Me and Sherry, we walk, in, we walk into the um the locker rooms, and the boys' locker room is down the hall, and ours is, like, closer up. So we walk over here whistling. So we duck up into the freshman locker room. And then I, I, I swear I thought he walked by. So I, I, I look out, and I'm like this. And then all I hear is, what are you doing? He's behind me. I was like, he's like, so how are you out of play? I was like, bro. What are you? But I was sneaky. You got, you got caught. <laughs> caught in that. You gotta be better than that. You gotta be quicker than that. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. It is Friday morning, y'all. Well, afternoon. It's Friday afternoon. So I've been up for about like two hours. Um, it looks like we might be finally getting a roof done. So there's this big ass truck with a whole bunch of roof shingles on the back of it sitting in front of the house. I think they're trying to figure out if they're at the right house or not. Babe, you're at the right house. Just back that puppy right on in so we can get this party started. The dogs don't like the fact that... Oh, where Bentley at? Oh, he's on that side. They don't like the fact that the truck is sitting out there. I'm looking at, at the truck and whoever's in the truck is looking back at me. That's actually kind of awkward. Should I not be looking? Hold on, I'm going to show you how the truck. So, that is the truck. Let me bring it down where it's not... Can you get out of my mouth, please, sir? I'm trying to show the people the truck. It's here to, to deliver the shingles. Tyro. They low-key probably trying to figure out like how the hell they supposed to back that truck into our driveway. Our street is so narrow that they're probably gonna have to tear up somebody's yard to get them shingles up in here. So they that's probably why they're sitting there. They probably like, they probably hate their life right now. They probably thinking, like, really contemplating on, on quitting their job at this current moment. Because if it was me and I had to deliver some shingles in that big-ass truck, I almost definitely quit my job. Because what? I'm just sitting here mad. Because the people got to deliver the damn shingles. And, Cairo, you don't even bark, Cairo. Cairo is not a barker. You do it because you see Cairo, me, Billy do it. We all know Bentley an asshole, but now you trying to pick up on his asshole-ish ways? Yeah, I said it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> they got an attitude. I think they gotta put the shingles on top of the house. Keep cleaning this damn glass. And him, him and his nose prints just look trifling. Look like we live in a damn project. Move, Cairo. Cairo, can you move? Go! 
Y'all think I'm legit putting the shingles on top of the house. Ky Cairo, go climb. If you ain't gonna bark at the people like Bentley is, you might as well just go climb. Because why are you in my face? Jesus. Billy ain't gonna do shit. Acting like a guard dog. Kyra, you definitely ADHD. You cannot sit still. Don't be pushing him all out the way. You little bully. Y'all see how he just bogarting him? whining for go no go So now I'm in Walmart trying to grab the rest of the stuff that I need for Cairo's birthday party. Um, oops, excuse me. Um, they have these little, are these things called like plushies or something? They have these, I found the birthday one. So I'm gonna get him one for the birthday. But this, this is really not what I came here for. I came here because I need to get stuff to make him a birthday cake. So we're gonna make birth him a birthday cake tonight because I don't wanna have to deal with it tomorrow just in case it doesn't go as planned because I've never made a birthday cake for a dog before. So not sure how this gonna go. <clears throat> so yeah, that's what we are doing now. So far I found a, oops, I dropped something. This little electric balloon inflator because I got a bunch of balloons I need to blow up. Um, I got this, but I really can't explain what I need it for. But I got these to make his cake. Um, I think I showed y'all this already. I got a little knife thingy thingy so that I can like spread the um icing on the cake. And then I got these little cake boards to put the cake on. And then I got this little thing to cover it up with so that it don't like get stale and then i got him some birthday candles so far now i'm in the kids section looking for him something to wear y'all this would have been perfect but i don't think he can fit it all i need is the shirt i don't think i'm gonna put the pants on him i just wanted the shirt but i don't know y'all Cairo is huge let's see how big this is yeah Cairo ain't gonna be able to fit none of this that's an 18 month. Oh, they got a 4T in the um Woody. I still don't think Kyra gonna be able to fit that. That would have been perfect though. Why is he so big? Alright, so I'm just trying to see if I can find a kid shirt or something that he can wear. That's like Toy Story, Toy Story theme. I'm actually kind of shocked that I found the PJs, but it's going to be kind of hot outside tomorrow anyway, so yeah, long sleeve, that might not be a good idea. Yeah, that might not be a good idea, so hopefully I can find something else that he can potentially fit, like a t-shirt, like why they don't have like little kid t-shirts? A little check-in, I have not found an outfit for Cairo yet, but... I found this, I think he'll like this, and it's super hard. 
y'all, he chews up everything. So this seems fairly tough. So I'm gonna get that for him. That's like $15, but whatever, it's his birthday. And then this is the stuff I got to put in the gift little bags for the other dolls that are coming. Found those, these little, um, what are these, bananas. And then we got some little treats I'm gonna put in there. I got some balls for them to play with tomorrow while they, you know, play or whatever. Um, and that's it, I'm about to find in some treats right quick. Y'all, let me show y'all mainly in Cairo's favorite trees. Where it, they're actually Bentley's favorite trees. These were his absolute fave. He liked these too though, but he loves these. So I'm gonna give him some some treats. I need to put I need some treats to put inside the gift bags, but I also need some treats for the party. Well, I guess they're gonna have cake and then you can't give dogs too many treats. So I don't know. I don't know what other trees should I get. These look like little chips. You see those? You know what? I can get these and like put them in like a bowl to make it look like chips, like snacks out on the table. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, get what I'm trying to say. That's what I could do with these. It was broke and they marked down to $6. What y'all think? I think it's a good idea. Um, yeah, I don't know what other treats I'm gonna get for the party. <sighs> I'll be back. Uh, it is like 11 o'clock. It's probably past 11 and I am up. Tyro and Billy, out of the kitchen. Go. I am up peeling potatoes for this damn birthday cake. I already put the cake, go, out. I already put the cake in the um, oven, but now, Klein. You were really testing my patience, Tyro. In a minute, you're not gonna have a birthday party. Anyway. I already put the cake in the oven, but in order to make the frosting, you use potatoes and some yogurt and milk, I think. I have to look at the instructions again. So I have to peel the potatoes, uh, cut them, and then I'm gonna boil them, boil them, so they can get soft or whatever. Cause, ouch, did I just cut myself? I feel like I'm always Cutting myself. How do I cut myself with a potato cutter? Maybe I didn't cut myself. It, it definitely feel like I cut myself, but I'm not bleeding or nothing. So, um, what's I ready to say? So I'm gonna just cut these, slice them up or whatever, slice and dice them, and then I'm going to bed. Once the cake is done cooking, I'm gonna let it needs to cool off or whatever. Apparently. Um, so I'm gonna go to bed. Um, well, no, I'm not. I'm gonna put the, um, treat bags together. So he got some treat bags. I got, well, I showed y'all, didn't I? I got some treats to put into the treat bags for his friends. Um, so I'm gonna probably put those together tonight. And then I'm gonna go to bed. And then I'm gonna wake up. I have to get up early. Like, I, I. It's gonna be hard for me to get up early, but I'm gonna have to get up early because I have to put together the, um, what is it called? The balloon uh, arch. I did get a little balloon blower upper. So hopefully that'll make the process of getting the balloons um, together quicker. And I ain't gotta blow them with my damn mouth. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm gonna get up and do that. Um, I got to clean the patio off, which I was planning on doing that today, but we didn't get home from Aaliyah's meet, um, early enough for me to do that. I already put Cairo's gift together. He had a few gifts that we got him. I feel like I had more, but I don't know if I'm just forgetting where I put it or if I'm just tripping and I didn't get them more because it was only three things. And I'm like, that's it? I thought I got them more than that. 
but I had put them in a little gift bag for them. So I got that already put together. I was trying to decide if I was gonna make this, uh, if I was gonna make Cairo's birthday party a separate uh, vlog. And I really don't know yet, to be honest. What you think, Cairo or Bentley? Y'all think I should make it into a separate vlog? Huh? You don't know? Yeah, I don't know either. Um, I don't know, y'all. We might be ending this video. For the sake of me not having... Because sometimes I don't have enough footage. And I'd be like, damn, I need to record more. And then sometimes I'd be having too much footage. And it'd be good footage, so it don't be footage that I necessarily want to, you know, get rid of. Um, and it don't be enough footage to, like... It wouldn't make sense for me to cut it up into two videos because it'd be like... It'd have no intro or little stuff like that. It'd just be, like, weird. You know what I'm saying? Like, you just open, start the video and it's, like in a random place, you know what I'm saying, in a random scene or a random day and it just wouldn't make sense. So, I got a feeling I'm gonna get a lot of footage for tomorrow. We'll see. We'll see. I'll be back.